the shepherd. What day is it? It's Halloween. <laughs> birthday. Well, it will be on my birthday, the 31st, yeah. And you just dressed up a little early to help me celebrate next week. Okay, we're looking at a monarch butterfly. And uh, he's, uh, well, okay, these are some pictures I made today. Cone flowers. Oh, uh, yeah, they're cone flowers, one of the kinds, one of the most beautiful kinds, I think. And like I say, these are late blooming flowers that I got today. And uh, now, look in this batch, let's see. There's a big butterfly behind the... Oh, you saw one? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's where he was. I couldn't see him. Okay. This, this is uh, just what you have, like, uh, it's white and red and stuff, and it grows in the yard. Okay, here's a little critter that got up on a thing that I, I kind of turned the stick around and took pictures of him. I don't know what you call it exactly. I would call it a wood moth if I was naming it, but I don't know. <laughs> okay, well, speak up if you want to tell me what, mm, what kind of wood moth that could be. Okay, this is uh, goldenrod flowers. Uh, and they're, a lot of people uh, allergic to that one, huh? No, they're not. That's oh. a myth. Oh. It's absolutely harmless. It's not one of those flowers that gives you... Okay, this is the stream that runs through uh, South Fayetteville, and I was trying to get pictures of some of the flowers growing down there, but uh, it's a stream you've seen many times, and here's a tall, tall plant with beautiful yellow flowers, and I might have a picture of it from a distance there. Okay. You're a grasshopper? <laughs> yeah. He's not really that big. <laughs> I just cropped the picture to get him to uh, show up some detail. This is uh, another thing that I'm surprised I found still in bloom, and I can't call its name right now, but what color is it? Well, I'd say purple, but probably red. <laughs> yeah. What about this one? This is also a rare late blooming flower because it, I mean, it's... Things are changing. Yeah, I'm surprised there's this much there. It's a very wet spot in Fayetteville. And uh, okay, here's a yellow flower. And this one, uh, well, we'll see about three different versions of it. And I like people to get a chance to say what they think it is. And sometimes John and I go over the things when he's here ahead of time to practice on it. but. Here you see a, a butterfly one it? butterfly at the top oh, and then beautiful. one up over in the corner. See that one? It's, like it's a, a smaller kind of butterfly. And this is the two different like ones. like eyes on there. Uh-huh. Yeah, they're beautiful. And this is tall that, grass. The only thing I know about flowers is that most of them have leaves that number from the Fibonacci sequence, if you know it. Oh, I don't. Mm -hmm. This is tall grass anyway. Uh, <laughs> and that's, see, the little thing I'm holding with my finger. You uh -huh. see those all through the summer. And Something. in this wet, particularly good place, there's lots of it. This is milkweed and all those things climbing on it. It's two different kinds of insects that get on milkweed. Those little orange spots yeah, are insects? Yeah, two little, well, those, well, and that's some of their babies in the back, but oh. they're two different, bigger things. Oh, this, wow. that's you know what that is? Basket flower. Hmm. And that's one growing in my yard. And uh, I think you may have seen it since it's been there. Okay. Until next time. See you, D. Okay, D. Shepherd. Here's uh, the Veterans 5K race coming up this year again at the National Cemetery and this honoring Lorna and her late husband and uh, they were big contributors to the organization and still uh, supporting it even though he's he's gone but uh, she's still working for 
National Cemetery Improvement Corporation and the Fayetteville National Cemetery. And there's a common site for Fayetteville. Yeah, it, that's a, a doe, I think, yes. A young doe, I believe. You can see she's still got spots. Spotted fawn, just getting grown up. And they're all over the place now. Yeah. You see them at your house, I see them at my house. and On 71 business. <laughs> All over. Look at it. Looking oh, back, Bambi. they are so beautiful. And uh, look at there, looking back straight at me, like, are you gonna quit taking my picture now? And look, it's the same one, but she keeps moving and posing for us in different ways. And I, I just had to get a bunch of shots of this. And some, some people actually don't live where there's any growing in their yard. <laughs> But these are within four blocks or something of my house, and probably some of the same ones that come there. Okay, this was down on the square on the weekend. This is a skipper, a kind of butterfly, and you see the, the colors it has in it. And how, the how big is that? Oh, it's about, mm, you could hold it in the palm of your hand. And there's a different kind of skipper, and now we oh, go that's back. A, that's a good angle. Yeah, these, these are spurry on top. Right, and it makes it look like a moth, but it's mm -hmm. not a moth. Uh, but gee whiz, these are beautiful, and I just caught them downtown uh, near the square. And uh, I just stood there a couple of minutes and made a few shots of those. and. So well, these are good enough if I crop them, so you can see them on TV. Oh, <coughs> great shots. Okay. Uh, Different year there. Bud and Nancy Nancy Saunders. Well, that was 2016. We lost Nancy this past week. She mm -hmm. uh, she passed in uh, her her funeral. Well, it'll be late. It's it. It won't. It was on Tuesday, the twenty third. So uh, can't tell anybody about it really. But hope you are one of those who heard about it and went. And here's another type of butterfly with lots of spots on it. And some fur on that one too. It looks like. Yeah. Yeah, and this is showing the little. Uh, is this near pink, your house? Pink flowers. No, these are all down near the creek that I was showing you. Mm -hmm. And uh, here's a monarch, and it was out there, and it. Well, actually, I don't know how many flew by me while I was there, but this one spent a good bit of time on this thing. It's a, I believe it's a female monarch, and on those tiny asters, tiny flowers, and there just aren't a whole lot of other flowers right now that are still in bloom. But he actually got, he got on some other things I wanted to see, and before I could get over to where he was, I'd miss getting him along with those things. So I was just happy to have the action I got out there. D, thanks for making my Birthday, good one, mm -hmm. and thanks for having another birthday. Oh, thank you. Bye.